everybody, welcome back. Unboxing time. Mary's here. Hello. We're here to open up our November 2017. Oh, I'm so excited for it. Ferrera Market Box, or Ferrera Box, I guess. Okay, now is this her second one? Third. Third. Fourth. We did Disney Horror, and or Disney Anime Horror. Okay. And now this one, which it's, honestly, I don't remember what the theme is. Is it bi-monthly or every month? No, this is every month. This, this one's every month. month, yeah. Okay, people. We opened so many boxes, I literally cannot keep them straight. It, do, it does get a little tricky. Uh, but this was like $45 a month. Uh, if you go to their website, I have a link in the description below. If you want a monthly uh, subscription, you have to go through PayPal, or you can just order them one off at a time. Plus, they have a lot of other cool collectibles and stuff you guys can go buy. What I love about this box is you always get some premium Funko stuff in here, and I think it's like one in ten boxes end up with a chase. Oh. Uh, something. And we've ended up with some nice chases. And they had some Black Friday mystery boxes with guaranteed chases. I did get those ordered. You'll see them on the channel when they get here. Oh. Um, but yeah, this ought to be pretty cool because, again, I don't remember what the theme was, but we've loved these because it typically comes with some blind bag stuff. Yeah. And then, you know, like the horror one had like three it's cops in there that, that were really cool. stuff that we could probably cool. turn this into a two-parter. If, really if we wanted to, but we get so many boxes and blah de blah she was already saying, so we won't do that to you. <laughs> That's what GameStop boxes are for. <laughs> <laughs> We can't really say because I don't know what's come out and what hasn't, so we aren't going to say anything. Okay, do a little feel. Oh, this is the one that had like the spiders and stuff in the Halloween one too. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Had all the nice little stuff. Yeah, there's definitely, okay, let's, let's get rid of some packaging here. Let's do Mary's job. <laughs> Actually, I think stuff's on that. I don't I know if that's so. going to come out of the way. Um, I wouldn't force it too much. I'm not going to go too crazy here. I just want to move some stuff out of the way so we have a little bit of room to work. There's a lot of stuff in this one, a lot of boxes. Cool, okay. Well, I'm gonna, I have my hands on something clothy. It might be socks. Okay. So I'm just gonna start, because it might be socks. Ooh, it is, and those are cool. Dang. Oh, so this might be like Heroes or Comics. Or Justice League. Could be, could be. I don't remember. Because it's definitely one movie Wonder Woman. That's nice, dude. Is it? I mean, it's kind of movie Wonder Woman, but uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Nice. These are some primo premium socks too. I can even tell through the plastic. That's just some like high quality stuff. And this is uh, the box that I got my My Hero Academia All Might socks in that I love so much. Oh yeah. <laughs> cool, man. Good start. Good start to the box. Okay. I know there was some small stuff over in this corner if you want to start small. Or, I mean, you can do a feel around if you want. I was just pointing that out. Okay. Yeah, those are nice. Small thingy over here. Ah, uh, I thought I'd be... Oh, cool! Harley Quinn die cast... Or uh, metal die cast. Yeah. Oh, that's nice. That's nice. I thought she had... Uh, yeah, she doesn't have any, like, weapons or anything, but... No. Jeez, they made her busty. Well, she's, her, her torso is pretty much all bust. I, yeah, I guess that's part of what it is. But still, that one's really cool. Yeah, they, they, also, they often give us Jada medals. Sometimes there's Kid Robot in here, uh, uh, Loyal Subjects in here sometimes. It's all the really great premium collectible stuffs. That's why I love this box. It's always way worth the money. And I'm surprised how few people like in the unboxing community are aware of this one. Because, you know, well, at least... Well, you didn't know about it until we started hunting for boxes again. Right, and some of the folks out there told me. And then when I was looking, I was like, there's only a few people doing these unboxings. And, like, a lot of the, the majors for me, the people that got me into unboxing, I'm not seeing them do it. I'm like, you guys should... You guys would be into this box. Okay. Let's go... That's just a card telling stuff. Ooh, we got a dorb in a case, so I bet we might got a chase dorb. Here's a little something-something. Oh! Star Wars. Tracking keychain. E? Ta tag it, track it, find it. Oh, so does it have like a little GPS locator or something? Ah, cool. Attach Fond Me to your valuables and use our app to find them fast. Yeah, basically. Oh, that's cool. I mean, it's just cool as like a thing here, but this is pretty cool. Now granted, I'm not really somebody, I'll say this and then you know it'll happen, but uh, I'll take a chance of jinxing myself. I'm not really somebody that ever really loses things of value like that. <laughs> it's pretty rare, uh, but still, I love this idea. And even just as a keychain, I kind of, I dig that. This little weird, like, chibi-esque, um, chewy, mm -hmm. chibi-chewy. 
<laughs> that's fun to say. Chibi Chewy. Chibi Chewy. Nah, nah, nah. Chibi Chewy. <laughs> that's cool, dude. And that's something totally different. So, I, yeah. Nice. Good job. Nice find. I wonder, I'm sure, Ferrera Box also, it's a little bit different for everybody. So, that's yeah. also part of the fun of, with an unboxing is you can watch multiple unboxers do it because everybody's going to get, you know, a certain amount of things different. So I, I like that in some boxes. I wouldn't want that in all my boxes, but I like some boxes doing that, so. Oh no, it's empty! No, I'm, just, <laughs> no. I'm trying to find some things. No, I know. There's at least like a couple of pops and a door in there, maybe more than that. I, I, I didn't really get it. Yeah, that's the pop protector okay, that you're talking about. Okay, I'm gonna, I think we're out of like the time. I don't think there's that's gonna why, be any... Oh. Uh, oh, that's pretty cool! Okay, um... I haven't watched any Fast and Furious, so I have a new idea. It was Brian's, it's one of Brian's cars, so that's from Fast and Furious, which was four. That was the fourth one. That was when they kind of returned all the original players. It was after the, god, the Tokyo Drift. We'll just say Tokyo Drift. I don't need to say anything more about Tokyo. Actually, Tokyo Drift is not terrible as far as the Fast and Furious movies go. Just the lead actor is terrible. <laughs> I still don't know how that guy ever got to be the star of that movie. But uh, that's really nice, and it's, um, what's his face, um, um, Paul Walker, it's Brian, so it's one of Paul Walker's cars. Oh man, there's all kinds of cars you could have gotten there, cool. Yeah. Now of course Dom's Charger is like the most recognizable. Oh, the Ice Charger's in there? Oh, the Chevy Impala, so there are ones I believe from the newest movie. Oh, the Rally Fighter. Oh yeah, totally from the new movie, I'm sorry, what? Um, yeah, the Hypersport, yeah. Uh, Dom Chevy Fleet Line, where he's taking off everything that he doesn't need. That was actually cool. That might have been the best, most ridiculous, but best part about the latest Fast and Furious movie. <laughs> I finally watched it, and I'm like, oh. I know these things are just stupid, cheesy, bad, fun, like lovable, but man, that one was pretty stupid, cheesy, bad, fun. <laughs> Wasn't that the one where you're, you're leaning out of the car and the rock is going like, yes. let me just redirect this missile here? <laughs> yes, that's that one. <laughs> all right, all right. So, let's go, okay, all right. There's three pops, a dorb. Are those all pops? In the back, yep, those are both. Pretty sure, yeah, those should all be pops. So, yeah, so let's pull, let's pull this pop. Cause... I think you have that one. Did it come from the, well no, it might be the other, there's like, there's version, it's Pennywise from the movie. I don't remember if this is the one I got, there's other versions, this is with the boat. I know obviously it's not the chase, it's not the FYE with the teeth, but there was another version of this, so I don't know if that's the one I have or not. But still, what does the chase look like? Uh, I don't know, because it's like it got can it got like pulled after they had sold a certain amount, so it's like insanely rare. Why did they get pulled? Oh, uh, there was some kind of licensing thing. I don't know. I didn't follow Weird. the story that much. It happens sometimes. Like with the Mummy ones um, from the Mummy movie, they uh -huh. were going to make a Tom Cruise one, and when they sold them, they had to pull the Tom Cruise one because he. Like, I never gave you guys my likeness rights. Uh, if you grab a pop, I'd grab that one. Still, one very on cool. This side. Yeah, on your far one okay. over there. Yeah, in the back corner. All right. Um, very cool. Ooh, oh, nice. John Wick. Anyways, I wasn't actually done, by the I'm way. Sure, I thought... But I was going to say, um, hopefully that's not the one I have. If I do, that's fine. I got friends that'll love it for Christmas. Okay, John Wick. <laughs> very okay, nice. Chapter two. Yes, yes. Well, they didn't make John Wick chapter one. That was like such a snobby thing to say. Well, they didn't make John Wick one ones. Oh my god! Like, what? It, what? Don, why don't you know? <laughs> I don't. For some reason, he kind of reminds me of the John Travolta character from uh, <laughs> Pulp Fiction. Oh my god! It's it's grown up Ted going to a Halloween party. Is John Travolta <laughs> from Pulp Fiction <laughs> with a gun? Well, no, that makes sense. <laughs> Cool. Now there's also Chase on this one too, but uh, that's fine. That's fine. That's really nice though, because I do not have any of the John Wick ones. I think there's a couple versions, or is it just him and the Chase? I don't remember. You guys, I guess, can let me know in the comments. Cool. All right. I haven't seen either of the movies. So. Yeah, I need to show. I haven't watched part two yet, but you, you might. I don't know. It might be a bit violent for you, but at the same time, you might. You well, might be it down depends on how gory it is. I don't really. remember. I don't remember. I don't think they did linger on gore or anything, but. 
Okay, this one I'm about to pull has a sticker. It is not a circle sticker though, it's a square sticker. So I'm thinking, think geek? So it's some kind of exclusive. Ooh, cool, the gold Hot Topic Jack Sparrow. I did not buy this. And I actually wanted it. That felt more square to me than rectangular. Ah, oh, cool. Because I still love the Pirates movie. Well, I enjoy the Pirates movies. So what happened was is they, they, they had the same problem. We did too many uh, rock candy. Uh, <laughs> so they, they, they were watching our videos. They stole your idea. Hey, what if we just paint a bunch of these gold? <laughs> this is just like, we were just like, if we ever do our own award show, we're just going to take this freaking rock candy sorceresses and just free them gold and use them as trophies. Yeah. I always liked that idea. But yeah, man, I'm excited to have this. I think I have regular Jack from this version. I know I have the original Disney Jack, but I don't think I have anybody else. Or did we get Will Turner? I don't know. Oh, here, I, di I didn't really linger on that enough. Really... That's seen the back of the box, I can't really say. Well, we gotta pull this other thing anyway, so. Well, okay, fine. Uh, we did get Will Turner. Cool. I'm glad somebody remembers what we got. Too many pops, guys. Too many pops. Okay, so last but not least. Yeah, I didn't feel anything else in there except a, yeah. a dorb in a case, in a pop protector case, or a dorb protector case, I guess. So I'm assuming it's something really cool. Oh. It is. Ooh. It is Spider-Man Homecoming. It's a maskless Peter Parker. Yeah. And it is a chase. Yes, we got the chase. Yes. Awesome. I love it, man. See, that's and what that's he a, normally looks like. And it's always just fun to get a chase, even if it's something you don't really care about. But, you know, and even in Dorbs or whatever. But, I mean, come on, dude. It's, it's unmasked Peter Parker. So that one's awesome. That's one I actually, like, I would be excited to buy. You know, not, not, I'm not just happy just to get it. I'm, like, actually stoked about and, having it. And the dorb face actually looks suitable for him. It totally works on him. And the paintwork and stuff on the actual dorb, the body and everything, the colors are gorgeous. Mm -hmm. That's really, really cool. Oh, I, I was like, it looks kind of murky, but they didn't pull the film all the way off of the actual pop protector, so that's part of it. Oh. I guess maybe they just, they pulled off, yeah, okay. Well, it's probably an, an, oh. another layer of protection while it's uh, shipping. Yeah, that makes sense. I'm not gonna complain, but oh yeah. Yeah, okay. it's a lot, lot cleaner on the colors. Nice. I mean, she showed you, but I just, just in case, I just get that in there. Oh, that is awesome. That is awesome. So we got a market card to look at. Yep. Nothing else in the box. Yay! I made that. I totally made that. It's a holiday card. It's a Christmas card. Maybe there wasn't a theme, by the way, this month. And I thought, I think they usually told you the theme in the next one, but I don't remember. I'm not really getting a theme out of that, which is fine, because it's awesome stuff. Yeah. I'm just looking at what all they've got on the uh, shelves here. Uh, look, it's an Ewok head. <laughs> yeah, I, I didn't get to show them if you want to show them. Yeah, it's literally just kind of a Christmas card, but they don't really have a message or anything for you. It would have been nice to see Or maybe, month, maybe we're supposed to de decipher something from the object shown. Yeah. Maybe if you figure it out, they send you a Chase something else. I don't I know. Get to Chase Pennywise. Zoom in here. Come on. <laughs> yeah, there's not one. There we go. It's kind of funny, too, because I just looked up in the monitor, and it reminded me of, like, that old gag where, like, if you're, like, trying to trick a security camera, and you take a <laughs> picture of the room and paste it in front of the security camera. That's what that's kind of reminded me of. Do, 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 do. <laughs> I don't know, it just reminds me. Yeah. So that's pretty cool, man. We got a cool jade of metal. We got awesome socks. We got an awesome tagging keychain. We got a Fast and Furious card. We got uh, three awesome pop figures and a killer chase dorb. Mm -hmm. So again, all that for 45 bucks, guys. I'm telling you, the Ferrera box. Mm -hmm. Link in the description below. Um, you forgot to look it up. <laughs> <laughs> no. So, I'm... hey, do you like us? Do you really like us? Do you want to actually spend That's time such a weird with thing us? To ask you. <laughs> do you like us? Like, do you, do, do you like like us? Or do you? <laughs> I'm trying to vamp for you. I know. I appreciate that. it. It's the fifteenth, by the way. 
December 15th, 2017 uh, will be the next Drunken Movie Night. We'll be drunk. You don't have to. Me and my co-host Mike Elmore like to watch some crappy movies. Have fun doing it. Not always crappy. They will be this time, probably. Mary's going to be our ghost. Ghost. I am. I hope I not. Plan on Mary's the ghost of Christmas present. <laughs> no, uh, Mary's going to be our guest because <laughs> it's a Merry Christmas. Uh, it's like five, six hour live stream. You guys can come hang out. We'll be drunk. You don't have to. We play games. A quick flash you can play with us. <laughs> Sketches. Song parodies. Christmas cheer. Um, good times. A comment away, though. What did you guys think about Ferrera Box? Have you checked it out? What pops did you get if you have? Uh, what were you looking for? Just tell us what you got. What do you think about things? What's your favorite item? All that kind of stuff. We'd love to hear your thoughts. Geek out with us in the comments. Let us know what you have to say. Other than that, you can click that thumbs up button. You can give us that good old thumb of encouragement because we do love to be encouraged. I don't know why I did that. And I guess we're going to get out of here. We're going to go open up some more stuff after she looks at me crazily. And uh, we'll see you all later.